Following up from that, in the weeks following the cruise, I've had this profound experience and lesson in feeling and exuding. Lesson meaning you've learned or lesson meaning someone's projecting something to you that they want you to learn. It's an important distinction. What no, do you mean? lesson that I've learned. All right. Lesson that I felt into with regards to unconditional love for another. Go on. And so we just don't use the word lesson because it usually implies there's a teacher trying to assert knowledge into you and it's not like that. So lesson just meaning exposure to life that helped me to understand something. Right. Yeah. Exactly. So I wonder if Abraham can shed light upon the sweet spot of living in the present moment, living in the now experience following that inspiration, living this emotionally potent life, and yet having zero expectation about the outcome. Well, we don't want you to have zero expectation about the outcome because you know too much. You understand the laws of the universe. You know that you're a born creator. You know that you've put all kinds of things in the vortex. You know the potential is enormous. Everyday life reminds you of what you want. So we're not ever encouraging you to attempt the impossible of having zero expectation of the outcome because you have anticipation of the outcome. We want you to feel satisfied with the outcome as it comes out. We want you to be satisfied with a part of the outcome that is outcoming right now. <laughs> Maybe right now the outcome is an, an idea. I received a thought. Maybe the outcome is an impulse to act on it. That's the outcome. But when we say you never get it done, there is no ultimate outcome. But there are plenty of things that you can expect along the way. In other words, not zero expectation. I expect this to be fun and I expect myself to get better at it. And I expect to like it and I expect to feel satisfied. And I expect to meet other people that feel the same way. And I expect to get our juices flowing and I expect to have more fun when I'm with somebody else than when I'm alone. And I expect to really get better at this. And I expect to get better control of my vibrational balance. And I expect to wake up feeling better tomorrow than I felt today when I woke up. And I expect my body to make maintain with me I expect my vitality to be commensurate with the thoughts that I'm flowing and I expect to really love this life and I expect to have a really good conversation with Abraham today and I expect to have a delicious meal following this segment expectations are a wonderful part of your pleasure your whole vortex it is expectation your whole vortex is expectation yes there's a clarifying experience in terms of discovering newfound desire and the yeah. launching of that newfound desire yeah. love that cool Esther the other day found what she thought was a new desire and as she followed it further than she was ready for the desire fizzled out and it actually aggravated her and upset her balance but when it upset her balance it caused her to offer more rockets of desire and after about a week it turned out to be a really incredible clarifying experience for which she has great appreciation but during the process of the unfolding it was unsettling that's beautiful yeah